And here we go. Hopefully this won't be Highland again. And also not Merit, please. Some normal map. Possibly without water. And it's off Heim, okay. That's an interesting choice here. So let's see how is JSS map. Looking at the chef's position, he doesn't see any hunt. So he'll just have to start with either the chickens or the berries. The same can be said for Earth, obviously. He sees just some bears and two caribus. Okay, so he can go for some hunt. That's all right. And looking at Smart, he also sees two elks, so that's fine. What the dots? Shia also sees uh, the nice little herd. And well, for Fox, it was pretty far away. It was just all that far away, and he decided to take the chickens, which is obviously the right choice here. And J4, yeah, he discovered those. They were close to his tower, so he's in a good position there for the hunt. And we see a first relic here. Plus 20% wall hit points. Alright, if someone wants to wall up, that's the relic for him. Another relic. 10% cavalry shared archer hit points. That's a very nice one. Especially for J4, it's close to him. And if he can manage to catch it, he might be, have a pretty decent raiding cavalry there. Another relic. Scouting Pegasus. Well, okay. And six unit line of sight. Okay, why not? At least he'll have better scouting. But it's not something I would really want to fight about. And 5% talk thoughts and the rest hit points. Okay, that's also nice. Gonna help anyone. Another relic. 20% villager food carrying capacity. That's a very great one. And it's close to chef. So he might possibly take it for himself. Not that he really needs it as an Atlantean, obviously. But if nobody from his opponents takes takes it, he's gonna at least keep the field even. As for the TCs, J4 seem to be kinda okay. Chefs as well. That's okay. This is kind of in the middle. This is third for smart, but it's not all that very bad. It's kinda okay. This one is an an interesting position for Shia, because it's <laughs> basically at the side of the map, and well, it's not really in a strategic position to be honest. Overall, the TCs are okay, so this will be a pretty even battle. Looking at the gold, uh, JSS has some decent in the back. All of these guys have some decent gold here. And dot as well, so no problem there for all of them. Let's look what, at what they're doing. Shia is already building temples, so he'll be probably looking for an early up. J4 is just now building, so okay, just as well. And Fox is probably going for some fast heroic, as you can expect from Isis. Looking at the JSS, a chef is not just yet going, but he'll be probably soon because he already has the temple there and he's ready and up. Earth is also going up soon, he has just two dwarfs ready in and then he'll be up. And Smort, well, just waiting the same as chef. Shia is just now clicking into Fort City. That's going to be a pretty decent time. Sub 5 minutes, that's nice. And J4, pretty much the same. They have both both opted to build their temples in their bases, so we can probably expect expect them to take the second TCs. And we can see that Chia is already preparing some walls there against uh, Oranos raiding from the JSS. And Smart is up in right now, and Chef is very near to Classico. And Earth will be probably in the same spot as these guys. A bit slower, but basically the same.
J4 has found his Orox and he's in a safe position. This seems that this will go all the way to the side of the map, so he'll be in a pretty good spot to protect him from raiding. And well, is there another way to build a wall here, or does he want this open? Maybe he wants this open to lure the opponents in. But as we can see, <laughs> Chef is trying to go into some scouting mode here. And well, just as I was saying, the J4 has safe release. He was just found out by Chef. But he's preparing his walls as well. So he'll be defending against some raid in there. Fox is going for his second TC as soon as he upped. So he'll be building a middle position that will be quite nicely defensive for all the all the dots. And what's going on here? Shia is trying to find some villies here, possibly, and do some raiding. Well, <laughs> just those two guys. But they are enough to actually disrupt G-Force. Oh, wow. Yeah, okay, that was a very big help for a Chef, because now he'll be probably able to kill this one. And as you can see, Earth is trying to help him here. <laughs> trying to make an offensive wall. It's a pretty nice one. As it will allow some nice micro in on the military. But he's found out by J4 and the wall most probably won't come up at this point. But J4 is really taking this defensively. Because as you can see he's one against two. So it wouldn't be a really nice fight for him. I wonder in here. He is building his towers, so he'll be in a good position as this is pretty much unreachable at this point for JSS. But they are really cutting him off his third TC. And the next step might be taking this TC, uh, possibly by Earth. We'll see. This TC is being guarded by Shia to deny Smord this one. And we are seeing some nice fight in here, near the Willy, that has Spy on it. At this point, uh, Fox is building his blacksmith, which means that he will be up in, into Heroic soon. And really, this is a very decent spot for the defense. He will be able to help both of his sides. So it's going to be quite nice position there. At the same time though, the JSS are doing a nice job raiding and they are quite competent at what they are doing right now. You could see that Fox was ready to do some help in his base, but really was repelled. When Chef found out, but with J4's help, yeah, it's now Chef's turn to run away. Earth is trying to go through the walls here, where Shia is really waiting for him there, so it might probably not be too much of an advantage right now. And as we can see, Chef is doing his best to do as much raiding as he can and disrupt whatever efforts the dots may be having. Vox is definitely trying to defend this position and this will be a place for some nice battles quite soon it seems. Chef is really doing a lot of raiding here. He's trying to find all the possible willies uh, that Dot can have anywhere on the map. He has pretty good line of sight. He sees quite a lot. And uh, this is a kind of a tough spot because he ran into a blind spot kinda, which he will be having a hard time running from. Earth is calmly healing here. While 
Wow, Smart just found out she has Willis. And of course this army as well. Yeah, Earth is already going for some help here. And they will soon double up on Shia. And this Willis will not be safe. The same as these idols here. In a kind of a difficult position, but J4 is managing the chef right now okay. On multiple fronts. Fox is really trying to be at all the places he can. The kind of a reasonable position. Because he will be the deciding factor in this. This is the double really denying Shia any gold mining. And we can see that Fox and Earth just advanced into heroics. And Chef is <laughs> really doing everything in his power to make life difficult for J4. And he's pretty much succeeding in this. And we have some offensive ancestors here for Fox. Will they manage to take this down? Yeah, just in time. Just in time, at the last moment. And how about at this side? Did Chef stop J4? Not yet. But it seems he might. With a bit of micro. Yeah, J4 just gave up on this. Because it would be too costly for him. And as I've said, with a bit of micro, Chef would be able to pick his units off. Now, both, <laughs> as you can see, Smart and Earth are here. Which Shia can kindly used to attack Smart in his base. <laughs> and just took away the healing spring. But this is a tough position and he will have to flee there. Yeah, J4 decided, or decided, was forced to abandon this TC altogether because Chef just concentrated all the, on this battlefield and just disrupted his efforts as much as he could. As you can see, Shia is trying to take the third uh, of Smart and uses some flaming weapons for the fight here. Oh, that's tough a break. Shia just cast flaming weapons and Earth, well, just froze him. Alright, tough break, but this TC seems to be coming up because there is not really any army to stop it. And what's happening here? That's just Smart's army. Yeah, and that's probably a message for the idols. J4 was able to repel uh, with the help of Fox, uh, Chef's raiding, and Bill get the TC's, TC up in the end. Will he or will he not? Uh, yeah, of course he will. And as you can see in the middle, Fox was trying for some offensive migdol, some such, but Earth didn't really think so. And is written in the favor here. He has also some decent ups here. So he has already good position to go for some push. Chef is building his 30C, so he will have a nice position. And he is securing the 30C of J4. We will have... No, well... Now he will have access to it, because the, all this army is going quite nicely there. And Chef has just this few, and that's not enough to take on this. In the middle, Earth is trying to go into probably some double, but he will just have to turn back. Because Fox is obviously trying to spot this and stop Earth from taking the third TC, or even second, just. Uh, 
on this side. Shia is, yeah, engaging in some fun raiding. He already took the 30 C of smart. And, well, other than that, J4 is really keen on this TC, and at this point it seems he will take it, because part of uh, Chef's army is on the raiding there, on the north side. And yes, this TC will go to J4. This TC will go down? No, the Giants just saved it. Just at the nick of time. <laughs> Very nice use of the special powers of the mythical units. Quite some nice radio from Shia there. But same can be said about Chef, obviously. And this will be very costly to Shia. On this battlefield, Fox is kinda getting not what you would hope for. And just now it seems Shia noticed with all his much of his will is dead. <laughs> and Fox is trying again with to the right side, but still trying to secure this gold and possibly take this TC as well. This will be an important battlefield right now. And we have a Son of Osiris right now cast. At this point this TC most probably will come up, there isn't really any opposition to it. Chef is trying his luck here with the Raiden. And if he goes a bit north here he will find some more fun. But here J4 has really secured his position at his 3rd TC and is trying to push as much as he can uh, with Fox, who is at the same time trying to go through the middle and do some raiding of himself. And we have Earth as Balder. So will we see some emulation of J4's Ragnarok right now? Some willies already down again, and the Infalian birds getting some fun on the raiding here as well. <laughs> nice one. And we have the Ragnarok coming. Right now, when we look at the Heroic and Mythic, we have just Earth and Fox in the Mythic. Someone else possibly up in as well. J4 is going for the Balder, so there's going to be another fun there with his Ragnarok. Fox is up, and how about some interesting thing here from Shia? Still nothing. He's just containing the heroic, okay, why not? And we have some nice raiding from him as well. <laughs> that was like, okay, two wheel is gone. That sucks for smart. And we have a bit battle incoming from the Ragnarok. And at the same time, Chef is going to push at J4 there. Oh, this is a nice double. That will be soon joined by Fox on the south side. Chef is doing all he can here and just went into fortified, which means that taking down the TC will take a bit longer. And it's mythic. And right now, Ragnarok and Chef is going to be in trouble here. Right now, it's mostly about who will be faster with the Ragnarok. 
But the fact remains that J J4 is at 3 TCs, my art is at 2. So that's a much better situation for J4. Okay, that's probably a very nice misclick with the Titan Gate. <laughs> probably not what you hoped for. And yeah, Chef is getting wrecked here pretty much. How many upgrades does J4 have? Uh, decent basic line, that's fine. And how is it for Earths actually? Yeah, he has better ones, so he will have stronger heroes. They should destroy all those houses, just to house Shia. And flaming weapons from J4, so that's gonna be some extra fun there. And in the middle, Fox is really trying to build anything to divide his opponents, and he's really eating into smart here. So this means that Chef is on the defensive, Smart is kinda out of the game, Earth is forced from attacking to defensive as well to defend his friend Smart. So this is definitely in Dot's favor right now. And yeah, this is the GG. They seem to be going rather well for JSS. Chef did some really nice raid raiding. But his opponents weren't really all that worse than him. And they were able to raid very effectively as well. And Fox went through the middle very nicely. He was able to help at both sides as needed. And really well played. And the Chef's Titan Gate, that's very nice touch there. Let's have a look at the post game real quick here. Nothing extra special. Chef was really doing very well, of course. Fox as well. Looking at the improvements, kind of a standard stuff, nothing extra special. You can see Fox had very nice upgrades, which really helped him. J4 also decent ones with Earth and Chef. And yeah, that's it for this game.